So one of the most important parts of any good video is the audio quality. And although the audio quality is pretty decent on the Insta360 camera, X, the X3 and film on now, it's not crystal clear perfect. So in this video, I want to share probably one of the best upgrades that you can make to your camera to make the audio 10 times better. Problem is that when you are using your Insta360 X3 camera out of the box, with no upgrades or anything like that to the audio enhancement or you don't want to spend hundreds on microphones and stuff. The audio is okay, but if you're filming outside like I am now and there is a little bit of wind, there tends to be, you get wind noise coming through, audio from people's voices doesn't sound absolutely crystal clear. So what we can do is we can get these cool microphone covers which you can stick over your microphone ports on the camera. And what this does is it takes away all the wind reduction. You can pretty much film outside. You can film anywhere where you would get other bits of audio feedback. Just upgrade your audio essentially. So I'm going to play a clip now and I'm going to show you what footage looks like when I have no covers on the microphones. This is all standard. The wind reduction is turned on on the camera as well, but this is what it sounds like. And then this is a clip now which has the microphone covers on the camera and you'll see how big the difference is. So these are both mountain bike videos so there's obviously a lot of speed and a lot of motion coming in but it would work say for example if you're filming outside or you had your uh, camera extended on one of the big selfie sticks or you were hanging out the car window with your camera you would want to put these covers on your camera some microphones to enhance the audio quality so i'm going to cut to my office desk now and i'm going to show you how easy these are to fit so you can start getting better audio from your videos okay so we've got my insta360 x3 camera here and just so you're aware i'll just show you where the microphones are this is a microphone here at the top and this is a microphone here at the top so we want to cover these up these are what we're going to be using. These are, you can find the link in the description for these. Just some adhesive, like an adhesive circle, double-sided, and then a furry dead cat, as they call it. So just put my camera to one side a sec, and we'll peel two of these off, which they just pop straight off. There we go, we've got two there. And then we want two dead cats. And we have another dead cat, and these are just little furry things, and then the back of them is like a different material so it sticks. And all we're gonna do is peel one side off. I've got fat fingers, so bear with me. You just wanna place this so the microphone is peeking through the hole. Like so. Doesn't matter too much if they're square or not, as long as you cover them like this. Press them down to make sure it's all stuck and then peel the top layer off. And then we'll grab one of our dead cats and make sure you get the orientation right. It's kind of like a, it's not a circle, it's like a oblong or rectangle if you like. So I'm gonna just get it on. And then just push it down around the outside to make sure it does stick as well. And we'll go ahead and we'll do side, push it down, and there we have it. So you'll notice we have our moustache looking things on the side. And one other thing you may want to do, if you use a lens cover like this one that comes with a camera, you may want to just cut uh, these sections out here a bit, a bit more. I haven't done this yet, but I'm thinking of doing it because when you push this on, these aren't really deep enough and they will snag the microphone covers. But if you just cut this out a little bit more, it will slide straight over without interfering. Cause you don't want these to keep coming off and you have to keep buying more of them. You do get about 10 of them in a pack, so you've got plenty to play with. 
this slots over nicely there. Cool, and there we have it. Another benefit as well of having these microphone covers, which I forgot to add, is that the mufflers don't get in the way of your 360 footage. So you won't see those in the stitch line either. So when you're reframing your footage, you'll still get a complete 360 degrees without all that getting in the way, which is really, really cool. Even though it looks like a, a moustache or some overgrown ear hairs on the side of your camera. So hopefully this video was useful. If you want to grab the stick on microphone covers that I'm using right now, there'll be a link in the description to those below. You can get them on Amazon, real inexpensive, but probably one of the best upgrades you can make to get in better audio out of your Insta360 camera. Hope this video was useful, guys. Any comments on what we talked about, pop them below and I will answer them and help you out.